Unlimited? Unlimited data? For real? Where? I want some. Can I get some unlimited data? Hi, my YouTube friends. This is Miss Yo. And I was driving and my um, phone alerted me that it's time to do an update. And I wasn't too fond of it. I'm not really one to jump on to get doing um, updates like that. Because it seemed like they always mess your phone up some kind of way. Well, let me give you the lowdown. Okay. I'm going to get back to this. Let me give you the backstory. Why I don't really jump on doing things like this. I'm not sure if it's affecting everyone. I mean, per the research I've done, it is affecting everyone in regard to anyone who has unlimited data. I'm an unlimited data person. Meaning that... Back in the day when I purchased the phone and the plans, I went for unlimited data only. Now, I don't have unlimited daytime, but I talk to 12 people for free. And I'll be honest with you guys, I don't have 12 people I want to talk to every day for free. So, I don't go over my daytime minutes. Um, I don't go over my daytime minutes. I, I, I can't tell you the last time I went over, maybe like 2014-ish. Probably when I was still in contract or something. Um, and then they gave me minutes just to sit there. Yeah, they, they, they was nicer. VZW, Verizon, was nicer back then. But I had unlimited everything, meaning in data. Well, you know, they changed all that on all of us. AT&T, Verizon, Sprint, T-Mobile, it all changed. They tried to get everyone with the, well, I'll give you the name that Verizon used. It was... um the edge program and then they changed it it changed it again but thinking everyone who had the old their older plans they was just gonna get rid of it because you get a new phone um that's when they stopped saying you don't have to have a contract for your phone well you have a contract for your plan what's the difference anywho i didn't switch it and it's a good handful of people who didn't switch well they upped on my um monthly charges my bill was 107 it went up to 130 they stated they told me august 2016 that in november it was going to go up i believe that was just it was hogwash on how they did it it was very deceitful why because they put it on my paperless bill because i don't have bills um paper bills paperless bill on the last page and i'm like that was stupid so when I saw the $30 increase, they told me it was because of my unlimited. Well, I started doing the research, and I'm like, okay, you liars. Unlimited, first of all, it's unlimited with the handheld, meaning just your phone alone is supposed to be unlimited. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's a lie. The reason why I say it's a lie, and it's a little loophole, and how they get around it is because if you check all four um, carriers, I'm not talking about prepaid, I'm saying all four carriers, they all state around the 22 gig mark, your phone will begin to slow down. They use words like throttle, um, cap off. They use words like that. Yeah, it stop. It doesn't do much at 22. After you hit 22 gigs, it doesn't do much. Now this, like I said, this is for people who are unlimited, not people who use um, home internet. You know, you have a you know have hotspot. Your phone. I'm sorry. Your home is Wi-Fi. It's the you know hot spot, and you're connected to that. I'm not talking about those people, and I'm not talking about anyone who pays for a certain amount of data. I'm saying truly unlimited. At 22 gigs, they cap you off. They're not going to use the word stop because that would mean that they really means it's not unlimited. I'm not sure how can they keep using words of unlimited when the Verizon Wireless CEO said, "I'm not giving out unlimited nothing." Now, and unlimited data. Everything, when I use the word unlimited, you guys, I'm going to be talking about data. I may not say the word, but just know we're talking about data here. So, when that, when he said that, and he, I mean, he went on record saying it. I'm like, well, why do we keep talking about this unlimited stuff? So, when I started seeing my phone slow down, but they're going to tell me, they said, hey, that's not for you. It's for anyone who's new. Not true. Then they, I asked the reason why. I did my research and I wanted to see if Verizon was going to be honest. They weren't. They said they wanted to do that because certain people 
don't get to use their data. So for heavy users, they'll cap you off. <laughs> they cap you off so other people can use it. And I'm like, are you kidding me? We're talking about billion dollar companies. And you want to cut cap off the handful of people who have truly unlimited data? Whatever. So when this popped up on me, I saw it, but then I remember my sister was telling me she did the update and she was like, don't do the update. And I'm like, why? She was like, they took my Fox 5. Now, let me show you this. This is Fox 5. I've talked about this before, I believe. Fox 5 allows you to, let me see, it don't tell you on here. It allows you to tether up to 10 people. Um, is it on here? Will it tell me? Well, it's not going to tell you, but it allows you to tether up to 10 people to your device. So for us spending the $10, because it was $10 on the, um, on the actual Play Store. And this is for Android users. I don't go too deep into a phone talking about iP iPhones because I don't have an iPhone. I just have iProducts, but I don't have an iPhone. So I'm not going to go too in-depth about what you guys do. But for my Androiders... It allowed us to tether. It allowed anyone to tether up to 10 devices. And you pay $10 and it's good. Been using this thing for three years now. I don't have home internet because it was the purpose. I'm unlimited. Well, prior to all of this changing, I never had a problem. I mean, even my smart TV hooks up to it very quickly. I didn't even, <laughs> I don't have to do nothing. Like instantly once I click it on, which is, it's on now. It's on right now. It tells me it's on. And then it also tells me, you know, um, is it gonna, let me see if I can see if it's going to tell me who's connected. It's only one device connected, and it tells me. The crack phone temp. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I love it. But when she did the update, they took it away. Now, she pays an extra 30 for her unlimited. I pay an extra 30 for my unlimited. Like I said, I did research. And all the four plans all say that it's unlimited, but it slows down around to 22 gigs. Now, my only thing about the 22 gig thing is if it slows down at 22 gig and it totally thrusts you into using a 3G server, it's not going to pop up as 3G. It'll continue to say four, but the speed of it goes down to like a goes down to like 3G. And you can go on the, the websites to check it out yourself just as I did. But I'm like, if that does that, then you're capping me off um, really not using it. So it's a play on words. But why when she did her update, this one, that I have not done yet, that I always... See, they have to ask me if I want to do mine. I don't put it on that, that auto... No. She did this, and it totally wiped out all of her Wi-Fi. She had to contact um, Verizon. Verizon was like, oh... And when she went to go to Foxfly, Foxfly clearly said for the new operating system of Nugget 7.5, 7.0, this app no longer supports it. And it was like, oh, now in the beginning, it tells you that. Three years ago, it told me at any given moment, your carrier can stop it. So I understand that part. Why would she contact Verizon? They charge her another 30. Another 30. And went right back to Fox Fly and it popped right back up. I said, you guys are just greedy. So what she did was, did her 30, canceled it off, and now her Fox Fly work. I said, you guys are just so grimy. It's terrible. I am so sick of cell phone people. Oh my goodness, I'm sick, I'm sick of um, carriers. I actually, on my Twitter page, I went back and forth with people because I said, one thing for certain, two things for sure. Don't use the word unlimited to me, but then you cat me off. Then that's, you're limited me. Limit, don't limit me. Yes, I'm a heavy user. I can use over 100 plus gigs of, um, a month. They also said that they was going to stop people, like people who do that, like myself. They was like, we're not going to allow that to happen. <laughs> we're not going to allow that to happen. And we have all right just to stop you from having our service. I said, are they serious? I, they haven't stopped me yet, but uh, I'm like, are you serious? Really? You guys are greedy. There's no way in West Hale you're going to tell me 
we live in the United States of America, home of the free, land of, home of the free, land of the brave, home of the brave, land of the free, the free country. Whatever you want to use the terms of what USA is, we have so much technology that you're going to tell me you can't allow me to use all what I have on my phone right now as what I want it to be and what it was prior to. You guys give us 4G and then say, but don't use it all. That's like giving me candy and saying, don't eat. That's like saying, hey, here you go, Yolanda. I'm going to give you this thousand. But you bet not spend it. Huh? So I don't fall for the whole okie doke because it's bullshit. I don't fall for the okie doke of someone saying, get a new phone. They've been asking me for, to get a full, new phone for three years. Nope. Now I'm having battery issues. Hmm. Am I a conspiracy theorist? Yes. Yes. And yes, again. Do I feel like phones start to act up around the two-year mark? Yes. Yes. Yes, again. <laughs> um, but have I fell for the okie doke to get a new phone? No. Now, if they do take my full capabilities of using my Wi-Fi and tethering other devices, then yes, I would. Well, do I really want to go down to two gigs? I think if I power my phone up, you guys, two gigs is gone. I am a heavy user. I'm not going to lie. I, I just started over today. Like, I got my new plan today, and I'm already at 2 gigs. Today. Today. So, yeah, I'm not that one that needs to be capped off. But just want to give you guys a heads up. Be careful when you do updates, because it may take away something that you love or like. And then only that, not just be careful with that. L read the fine print. Unlimited can't be unlimited if you cap me off at 22 gigs. Unlimited, or you allow me to tether... Yeah, you could tether, but if somebody else use it, they only get seven. Seven gigs, that is. So you guys be safe. I love you. Leave your comments below. Have your cell company, your um, cellular company, do, did buy things to you or tell you one thing and do something else and, and take some stuff off of it and, and, and said that they was going to handle this. But did, Tell me that. Yes, please tell me that. I'm really curious to know. I want you guys to have a great weekend. Thanks for watching. Be safe. And I shall converse with you next time.